Several top executives at former President Donald Trump's social media app Truth Social have left the company as the site continues to struggle to gain its footing. Josh Adams and Billy Boozer are tech entrepreneurs with expertise in the industry and politically conservative views, qualities that Trump wanted for his Twitter-like venture meant to counter mainstream social media platforms, some of which have removed him from their services following the 2021 insurrection at the U.S. Capitol. Adams became Truth Social's chief technology officer, while Boozer served as head of product development. The two joined the venture last year and became central in Trump's effort to build his own social media realm that would allow him to directly communicate with the public. But both Adams and Boozer have apparently resigned from their senior roles, two sources familiar with the venture told Reuters on Monday. Politico later confirmed the executive's exits, also citing two sources. If Josh has left, all bets are off, one of the sources told Reuters, calling Adams the brains behind the app's technology. After Reuters' report, Politico released its own report saying that Truth Social's chief legal officer, Lori Hare Bednar, also quit the company. Truth Social tapped Hare Bednar to be the company's chief legal officer in October, Bloomberg Law reported. The Trump Media and Technology Group did not immediately respond to HuffPost's request for comment, or provide confirmation of the exits. HuffPost could not confirm the reason behind the executives' resignations, or whether they are still working for the venture in a different capacity. Truth Social's iPhone app had a technologically disastrous launch on February 20, experiencing low traffic, constant glitches and a 13-hour outage. After the launch, Truth Social plummeted in sign-ups and traffic, sinking to about 60,000 new users a week, according to the mobile analytics firm Sensor Tower. This is down 93% from its launch week, when it saw 872,000 installs during the week of February 21st, Sensor Tower's Stephanie Chan told The Wrap last week. We estimate that Truth Social has so far reached approximately 1.2 million installs since its launch. Users have complained about a lack of engagement on the app and issues signing up, with thousands of people still on the site's waitlist. Trump himself has only posted on the app once. Former Rep. Devin Nunes, Republican California, who now serves as a chief executive for Truth Social, told Fox News in February that the app was aiming to be fully operational in the U.S. by the end of March. Truth Social still has no app for Android users, who account for more than 40% of the U.S. market, according to Reuters.